I work with the Elderly Nutrition Caregiver Program, and Summer Food is uh, branches off from the Elderly Nutrition Program, and I've been there going on five years. And it's, um, I know it's a really good program, and it serves a lot of our children, because food is, you know, really hard to come by, and a lot of uh, our people are on fixed incomes, and um, it's just a good program. It, it helps out during the summertime, breakfast and lunch. And it gets all the kids to, you know, all get together and not forget, it, forget about each other during the summertime, you know. I think it's a great, great program because, you know, there's, there's many, many people that have uh, limited food supplies for them through the month and you know when, when school is out you know some of the kids they might not get maybe a meal a day and with this program it really helps them out Scott and Knox. Uh, I work at the Antelope Community Food Center for the summer food. I feed kids like from 8.30 to 9.30 and we prepare another meal and we feed them again from 12 to 1 and after that I pretty much clean up and yeah. Alright so the summer food program is just basically a, a little program that feeds all the kids from years pretty much 0 to 18 and what that is, is just basically feeding that feeds kids from the morning for breakfast and for lunch, but we don't do supper because that would be too long working here. <laughs> Today I'm uh, come and pick up my children from the summer food program. Well, with this program, I, I see this program pushing out a lot of nutrition uh, to our, our families that are, are needy families and so forth, and it kind of gives them a guideline to go by, you know, as far as what to cook and how much portions to give out and so forth. It would be nice if I could um, increase um, the program to some of the communities that don't have community buildings. Uh, we have these smaller communities and they don't have a building there, so those kids um, you know, go without the lunch. And if their parents have vehicles, then they transport them to, you know, the other sites that's operating. And, you know, some of their parents have a hard time because they don't have vehicles, you know, to travel. So it would be nice if every community could have one, you know. The overall impact is a good, a good meal. Um, the socialization of all the kids and, um, you know, just just all be together, sticking sticking together as one, and really appreciating the program because in the summertime it's you know like I said before times are hard, and it is a good program. It is for everybody, and I encourage any reservation anybody out there that could utilize it, go for it because it'll help your people, and that's our our goal is to help our people. Bye. Uh -huh.